Okay, so welcome <laughs> back in Dota 2. Um, this, by the way, the headless or faceless, actually it's a head, but he has a hair only without the head part, so I'm not really sure how to call it, but uh, yeah, this invoker is there for two weeks. <laughs> no need to fix it, it's okay to do it. You are not going mid. You are not going mid, are you? No fucking way you go mid, mid man. Go away, please. If he goes mid and I go top. I can go solo. Uh, okay, okay, I'm mid. Don't give a shit. Fucking! I'm, I'm not gonna be. I'm gonna be dual lane, okay, with this hero. Sorry, <laughs> not gonna happen. Oh my god! Because you know you need XP's. Like I don't give a shit about farm. I don't have to. I don't have to hit a hit a creep. That's the thing. I don't have to do it. But uh, yeah, he's like you know he randoms, then he cries to about the hero, and then he goes omit. Nevertheless, to be a invoker, okay. I we don't don't gank, please. I need my XP's. I need full XP's that I can get right now. They have words, by the way, on on top. Ganking on level one is bad. <laughs> yeah, this hero, by the way, definitely you know, you can't play invoker as dual lane. It's just I would even be solo against tri lane. Like I would be okay with that. At least I can get something from it, you know. But the dual laning. Wow, that wouldn't be good. By the way, changes about Invoker, the damage, look at that, 39 on level 1, okay. Very careful about that, it's really low, so right now the build with the... Um, this thing. Sorry, with the... with the... Uh, with the Blades of Attack is needed at the moment. Okay, it's really needed, so... Definitely Ice Rocket pushing the Exhort Invoker, but again... I feel like I would do actually these changes like better, because... They don't really understand why this type of invoker called, uh, you know, not called the Quas and Vex invoker is that good because it's not because fucking damage. Okay, that's actually the the, the less of it. Okay, the damage is just not important. So again, the change that doesn't make sense, right there. The damage is like you know, actually the last thing with with this with this type of hero with this type of build, it is really the last thing. I can, he has fast attack speed. Uh, the thing is, movement speed, that's the first one, okay. Mobility, that's the first one. You are able to escape like anything that you want. Alright, and then it's of course the combo, the easiest combo in a game, the, the Vex, you know, the Tornado EMP. That combo, anybody can do that. Anybody can do that, seriously. So. Those are the things that just basically, basically make Invoker, you know, right now. The quas packs. And that uh, attack doesn't mean anything. Unfortunately, right now you are just forcing more of this build. That's about it. So, yeah, I don't really understand this decision. Like, if I want to nerf Invoker in a sense of of uh, Vex and quas, I would nerf Movement Speed first. And that would be pretty huge nerf. So people would be like, okay, let's talk about it. Which one is actually the better one, you know? Or more, more, more useful one. Well right now, it's not even a question. Like in competitive, 90% times, the mobility like I wins everything. You know. No. He's actually faster than me right there. I'm kind of worried right now. Ghost walk. 
Alright. <laughs> Come on, there's a patch. Oh my god. Seriously, there's a patch on a mid on level 2 or some shit like that? <laughs> okay, that's funny. I actually juked him completely. I basically make f made fun of him, but unfortunately he has a support and they have awards, I think. So that's gonna be fun. But I played game before this one that I was recording, actually. He's level? What is level? Level 4. Wow, what a scrap. Right now he actually thinks he can do something. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, the damage actually... It, it, it's a lot, you know. It, it definitely means something. It's interesting that uh, um, the patch is level four. Like I'm not really sure what lane he was in. I was not paying attention, like on the on the colors, but hmm, it's interesting. I know two guys are missing from mid. It's gonna be kind of a difficult. Yep, I saw them. Yeah, these guys are definitely trying a lot right now, but uh, it's not gonna work. Again, I need XP's like, okay, I died, but that's fine. Like, at least the Spectre has completely free farm. And they have wards, by the way, completely. Maybe they are like a friends or something, because this is like pretty stupid strategy. What they are doing. <laughs> it's from the bottom, I guess, I don't even know, like, seriously. It's pretty weird to me. Alright, I need my face boots, like, immediately. So the build is, again, mobility build. Face boots, drums, use capture. That's the best you can get, actually. He's actually pushing this time. He's got the DD, so he can he can get an advantage right now, but whatever. He The advantage will end with the DD, that, that's about it. As needs be. He actually missed, that's funny. <laughs> can you DD go off, please? Thank you. All right, cool. I might may try the exhort one, but the thing is, <sighs> you know, Icefuck is trying to push that hard. You can you can clearly see that. But the thing is, it's just not that good. It it doesn't scale that good as my mobility build, you know. Again, right now the rune he knows completely. It's a top. Can we punch it again? Tis tedious. I'm kind of uh, worried right now. Okay, remembered. because he could he could get uh, it's a haste. Okay. So immediately when there's a hook or something, I need to go in this because you know cold step right now doesn't matter because he's got the haste, so it wouldn't even do anything. <laughs> Here we go. Now right now I can actually cold snap. He's haste. Alright, cool. I am committed. As I actually see him. Can't really help him that much. Thus and so. Plucked from the arcade. Nice. He actually got the kill right there. I got it. See. Nice, thank you. Thank you for destroying him. If I knew it, I actually wouldn't go there that he's that bad, but that's fine. <laughs> let me, let me, let me. Alright. Yes. Here we go, that's a kill. Like, really easy one. The patch is definitely like roaming and shit, but, you know, that's... I don't know, I like patch again with levels. <laughs> yeah, the previous game I played with Invoker, like, it was ridiculous. Like, we had CK AM combo. No career for 10 minutes, and I was mid, and of course with this invoker, like it was bad that I didn't game, so I was thinking like, okay, he's gonna go mid, so I had to buy a magic stick, because if not, then I would be pretty much screwed. And yeah, that's what happened. <laughs> I had face boot in my base for 4 minutes, yeah, it's funny. This guy is pretty much not really a team player, like I need levels, I'm, you know, my build, my, not build, the hero requires levels. Oh, 
Shit, my damage. Okay, I forgot again. Fucking damage. <laughs> I'm forgetting that I had no freaking damage, man. What about this one? Can't get it, this, even this one right now. Okay, right now, hold on a second. There we go. I don't think there's much happening. They have wards, so I don't have to call miss because they see everything coming through here, so that's gonna be okay. Look at that. Ganging combination right there. Spectre, Ogre Magi. He's gonna be raising very soon, I guess. He actually chose to deny, I don't know why. I, I don't know why there's a this girl. Okay, here we go. Finally some good items. I actually didn't take... oh my god. I forgot the key. I actually set it up on a key. I don't know, even know anymore. I think it's it's like a G or something. You know, put uh, from a stash to the... Uh, to the... Wow, okay. I didn't click it, I guess. I'm paying, I was actually not paying attention because I was looking at my keyboard, but the thing is, I think I clicked it. But they are pretty terrible, so I think we could win like easily. Because, you know, right now, free heroes at least are roaming, which I don't really understand why. I think I clicked it, because of course I would spam it other than that, so I definitely clicked it once. But uh, obviously it was not enough time. Okay, I'm gonna keep this, I guess. The problem with the with bit of wax right now is that I'm not on a mid right now, which means... I need like, you know, I would say 12 levels to be effective with the with the combo. Because right now on level 3, the EMP is not going to do anything. Alright. I think they have a lot of warding all over the map, so... They can move really right now, pretty much. But, you know, over, I don't know. We'll see. I think they are, they are... They have pretty terrible pick that I, you know, myself can pretty much disturb, d disrupt. But the thing is, like, the thing about Invoker is that if people build BKBs in a decent time, it's pretty bad to play Invoker because, again, magic community. Only thing that goes through it is my uh, is my uh, ice wall, basically. Other than that, nothing goes through the, you know, from my spells, nothing goes through it. So. BKBs definitely counter the Invoker pretty much, and not many people people build that. I don't know why you know, people <laughs> kind of tend to ignore that stuff. No thanks. No thanks. Yeah, let's actually tease him. Why would I fucking skill Exhort, man? That's a retarded spell. Like, why would you want. I mean, he doesn't understand the build. He doesn't understand my invoker. You need full Quas, that's it. Okay, sorry, full Vex. Quas depends on a lane. If it's too hard. You level it up. But no more than four. My mid is actually fucked. I was doing good, I think. <laughs> well Alright. Yeah, right now people are actually getting there, which I don't really know why. That's not gonna kill him because there are three people right there. No, don't port, you are idiot. Why would you pour it there right now? Like, leaving farm for not even kill? Oh my god. Yeah, I'm gonna skill the Exhort, yes. That's what, that, that, that's the plan. Concentration. <laughs> you know, as a Spectre, you don't want to do this. You just want to basically be AFK. If there's a certain kill... Alright, these guys don't have a range. Or I don't have a range for them. For this one, at least, I didn't. I want to miss. <laughs> Didn't happen yet. Is there a miss for these creeps? Or they are special? Okay, right now the crowd the Vex is 4. Right now the Spectre is everywhere, man. I I mean, I left bottom because of the Spectre, you know. That, that was the thing. I left because of her. You can actually kill him if he wants to. Okay, I'm getting some regen. Nobody's following him. Alright. Okay, let's see the mechanic of the creeps, okay? Well, that's cool. It's not that bad. Sometimes the catapult, I think, it's like retarded a little bit. Okay, let's go. Let's go. This is easy. I had to switch for my 
uh, tornado because it's not really that worthy in the beginning. You know, the tornado in the beginning is mostly used for finishing the guy. If he has like 200 HPs, you just release the tornado and go away. But of course, if he doesn't have magic stick, then you don't go away because uh, with the impact of the tornado like falling down, you can actually magic stick away. You can actually leap, you can do something before the damage is like applied almost. So be careful about that. If somebody has 50 magic sticks, <laughs> If he's gonna spam the shit out of his uh, magic stick, he's actually gonna avoid that stuff. Or heal himself away from it, so be careful. That's Dota. Dota 2 at least, I don't know about Dota 1, there's a lot of creeps. Okay, right now I'm getting to the position that I can actually teamfight very well, let's say. You know, teamfight in the sense of me actually killing somebody. I should have enough damage at the moment, let's see. I still don't. That's ridiculous. I do sometimes. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> I loved it. You know, 63 to 69. That was actually lucky that I didn't have that in the first place. Or I did have that in the second place. You know, every single time, if you are wondering, switch back. If you are attacking, switch back to the Vex. So that's, that's, that's the thing. But if you want some regen, of course, keep it on a quasi if you're not doing anything. Let's see his items. He's actually building BKB, which is smart choice. So he's the first one against me in long time that builds smart things. That's interesting. Okay, let's actually get this one. I think I could get get away from a punch. Let's try it. Nice, got it. It was a 69, man. All right. So next item, I I definitely like Yule Scepter. I think it's pretty cool. I guess never more, even more. It's not time yet. Do you like fucking stun him? Oh my god, this guy is horrible. This guy's fucking. Oh my god. I couldn't give him more vision than that. Sorry, I couldn't. <sighs> like the range, you know, it's ridiculous range. I don't know what he was doing. It was pretty easy kill on the guy that was building BKB, which is only item that can stand against me. By the way, if DK doesn't build BKB, if he if he wants to go like you know smart, like okay, I'm gonna get Azalt Kiras, he's pretty much worthless. Okay, so definitely, if you play against Evoker, always BKB. Always be giving. So it is safe. Okay, let's actually go. He's dead. Toast. 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 All right, cool. I didn't want to get the patch in that in that thingy, but uh, the good thing was that Pagna decrified the patch, so he actually took more damage from the fall. I think so. You know, it kind of worked out in the end. <laughs> All right, we got that. Yeah, I wanted the, only the less so he cannot cast stun, but unfortunately, it was like too close to the patch. But you know, it worked out in the end. That's the movement speed, man. Like with the Exhort Invoker, I could be like, okay, maybe I'm gonna Sunstrike him, you know, maybe I can do it. But with this, I can just run there and hit him, you know, multiple times. That that is the power of this, you know, of this build. It's ridiculous. It is completely ridiculous. Like that is the build. Okay, it's not about the f 49 damage. It hurts, but actually not that much. Let's go away. I think. Uh, he does have much HPs though. Okay, let's go back. The Yoskepter is good because, you know, if he initiates, basically anybody I can lift Pudge from, uh, like, eating somebody or I can pretty much control, uh, okay, let me actually get the other item. I can control um, DK if he doesn't have a D BKB. That's just intimidation factor right there. He don't have mana for anything else. That's pretty fucked up. Okay. 
the Pudge is on uh, Nevermore's ass. They would have to be friends because <laughs> he's ev he's always there. He's always with me. It's pretty funny, and that's why they will lose. I actually like to play against friends like they're like two or three because they are predictable in a sense. They're running together, so you know you can force them into things. As you can see, three people die on the top plus tower, and you get kill on Invoker. I don't know, man. It's a good trade for me. It's almost like a winning trade, because Leshrac, if he's not farmed, pff, easy. DK, if he's not farmed, easy. Especially with the Invoker, so... It looks pretty good so far. Alright, I have to switch actually right now. Alright, let's go through the mid, I think, right there. Mm. Yeah, they have wards, man. They have definitely wards right there. Like, everywhere, but that's fine. They are definitely trying very hard. That's, that's cool, you yeah. know. You can do that. Just drank your boots. Oh, fuck, man. Toast. Again, see? Friends. Good ones. Together. Together. Always together. I can't really do anything right now, I don't have cooldowns. That's, that's the only problem that is, other than the damage <laughs> with Invoker, that is... You just don't have the this, you know. I'm, I think I'm gonna go Agony. I'm gonna see what DK is gonna do. But the thing is, against this, I can actually position myself that well, okay, most of the times, that... It won't even matter. Okay, it won't even matter what they have. <laughs> because I'm not I'm not the target, like I'm not gonna be the target. The target is gonna be Pagna, this guy. Like I am target if they can't catch me, but I'm gonna be, you know, I can control the situation from pretty much long distance. So that's pretty good. Fourth wave. This I'm scared here. <laughs> so nevermore is boredom, which is which means Pudge is boredom, that's cool. I didn't buy this. I thought I did. I am committed. Okay, I didn't. <laughs> Alright, here we go. I fucking don't have a vision. Can we go in? Oh we go in. Fuck. There's a spectre actually hunting somebody. Toast. That's not really the best thing you could do, but that's fine. Alright, we got it. Alright. Cool. Uh, he releases, if you are like wondering, you know, coming to Dota in, in like, you know, not like four weeks on playing. That's new passive ulti that he releases uh, when he dies. Pretty much. It's kind of ridiculous, but he releases only half of the souls that he currently has, so... It's fifty percent more damage, fifty percent damage, and you know it, it's it's fine in most situations. Of course, it can be bad in some. That he ult is like perfectly. You kill him, and he, then there's like a second ulti, just finishing you off. That can happen. Let's see the DK. He's actually building. Look at that! I almost killed him right there. If I had gold snap, which I didn't, as you can see, I had to actually switch my spells. So. With the cold snap, you could actually, I could actually snipe him. And that's a good thing about Invoker, that against these guys that they don't have anything, you can pretty much snipe them. And maybe they are doing Groshan, by the way. Um, 10 seconds. I actually fucked up there a little bit. I really think they are doing Groshan. I don't know. No. The DK movement completely, like, looked like they are doing Groshan, though. No multicast. Okay, he's fucking crazy, this guy. Wow. Yeah, the damage just seems like definitely lowered. Like, <laughs> I'm hitting people, but it takes so t so much time it takes actually to bring them down. 
pretty much. Right now I have level 1 Exhort and I'm gonna keep the quest on free. There's actually no need to right now to do it on higher level. Okay, I got the combos right now. My team is pretty much safe. With this combo, when they don't have BKBs, my team is pretty much safe. Pretty much. <laughs> you know, we have Black Hole, we have like decent Enigma farms, so we should be fine in that sense. This is th pretty much dangerous <laughs> position. I don't know. Alright. Do, 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 do. The thing is, I shouldn't tornado like that. That's the thing that some with some combos, tornado is not the best one. Let's say Quixel is maybe even Enigma. Like maybe start it and then like not touch it because you know if if you if you if you tornado in a black hole, and it can be in the same time. It's pretty much wasted, the black hole. Okay, there's a haste. Okay. Fuck. Cool. Wow, let's like do the black hole. I was thinking like somebody's dead. I don't even know who was. Oh, it was Pagana. Okay. Then he then he black holed with the dagger. Okay. Well, that's that's interesting. So Pagana did what what she should. You know, if support dies for four people, that's okay. Like people tend to not sacrifice themselves for for high cause, basically. Boom! <laughs> cool. I, can, I gave him the kill. Because right now my build is actually finished, like the, cor the beginning build. And this is this is okay, like... I'm fine. Right now Agony would be actually the choice. They are building BKBs, um, but... I think we are fine with, with, with what we have. Of course with the BKBs, like if the whole team has that, that's... It's a problem, because 10 seconds of you not capable of doing anything. You can put out uh, the ice wall, that's what you can do, but other than that, it's pretty bad. It's really, really bad. I hate that. Because it kind of forces you, like, what, what should you do? With the normal team, it would be like normal team in a sense of communication, if I had any communication in a sense of voice chat. And I knew the guys, you know, so they know me what I'm, you know, calling. I, I would be like, okay, guys, just force them, BK force those BKBs, and then run the fuck away for ten seconds. And then, of course, without BKBs, again, it's it's easy. It's walking apart, but unfortunately, it's almost like forces you to, to I don't know, like get your cooldowns off, those spells off, <laughs> because you know it's like team fight. Ugh, what do I do? Fuck. All right. I think Agony will be the choice. They have two BKBs right now, but uh, still two guys won't have them very, very much. I don't think... Uh, that Ogre Magi is fucking crazy, but that's fine. Okay, he's actually got the range. No! Hold on, I'm actually gonna... end this right there. <laughs> Oh man. Like, they don't really have any cooldowns, so it was fine. I could probably just run away, but this is more effective. Alright. Whatever. Don't we have a Malphys? Yeah, we do. Okay, there's a Malphys. This is actually not good. Oh, there's nobody actually following. Oh, there's a following. But I don't want that. Hmm. <laughs> I've seen better situations. One of my favorites. I completely fucking missed him, that's interesting. Boom. Do, 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 do. Oh no! The tower is still there, kill it, Spectre. You're farmed. Fuck. Okay, first game with the Invoker, but it goes. Oh, actually, second one, but the first one, there was actually the guy left in the end, so it was like, yeah, I don't know. So I left. Pudge is dead, that's good. 
Okay, I'm gonna go egg him. Like, it doesn't really matter, but I'm gonna go egg him right now. I think this guy's quite. Oh, he's got like a double stun, right? Yes. The problem with I have with this is the 400 mana. Okay. It's a pretty big problem. I don't know. No multicast. He's gonna be Gaby right here. That's actually terrible right there. Ah, uh, it's seen better fights. <laughs> okay, with, and you know, fights with the mana, the, the, those are cool. Those fights are very cool. You know, when I have mana, then I can actually do anything, do something. It's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, thank you. I'm completely ready to go to the fight. No need to worry about hook. Yeah, <laughs> right there. Oh. I wish you'd go back. Like, I don't know. I'm gonna buy items if I die, not this one. Yeah, yeah, look at that. He's going back, definitely. Other than Ogre Magi. Eh? Oh, thank you for Bloodlust. I like it. I like being big. Oh, he exactly hooked him? No, he didn't. I, I heard hook. Hmm. Guys, I need to farm. There's a incoming wave of people. <laughs> Only you. Careful. Oh, they're running. They understand the game. If you don't have anything, run. I think they are still chasing somehow. Oh. I need to farm my rest of the Aghanim and then the hell can unleash. Hell meaning I'll be casting spells through three BKBs. That's fine. It's effective. It's, it looks cool. <laughs> I'm playing Dota to be cool, so. Yeah. I don't know. Okay, let's fish this. Maybe the combo, whatever. Or maybe the alacrity. So I can farm faster. No? Nah. Works. I can actually accurately on the Spectre, technically, with the, you know, with my Aghanim. Because it's gonna be 2 seconds cooldown on the uh, Invoke, so. The funny thing, I had to actually read the skill. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Okay, so I have the Aghanim. I'm just gonna kill this guy. Okay, snipe him. There you go. You know, being effective, again, I'm wasting time, but that's fine, it looks cool. Alright, so Aghanim is done. I kind of, you know, usually, in my beginning of Dota, I built Aghanim as a second item. I boot Aghanim <laughs> on Invoker, but uh, I was like, you know, recently, like, oh man, there's a lot of spells, so I'm gonna go for whatever, you know, like a BKB bullshit or dagger. It's, I don't know, I kind of uh, took something away from my style, and I don't like that. So right now, the style is Aghanim. Back. The core is back. I'm not gonna figure it out in a game with the um, with the wench that was kind of uh, ignoring the team. Like we were messaging her all the time. Like I don't have a query on the mid yet again. It's actually third time already. Like in a, in a pretty recent time that I didn't have a career as an invoker on the mid. It's kind of weird. They are not going Roshan, I think. Like it doesn't look like it. No. Like that could be DK hidden, you know, we have to be careful about that shit. Alright. Like the good thing is like I can if Enigma black holes like insanely, I can still switch it very quickly so I don't have to do tornado immediately. I can switch it to the uh, meteor, so it kinda works. They actually got it. I sunstrike I didn't have a cooldown so they went after my Sunstrike, which is which is actually interesting. I think they heard it. Yeah, they have to. They had to heard it. All right, I'm gonna get the combo, or keep the combo right now. It's pretty good. So they have ages. That's interesting. I don't think it's gonna help overall. Like ages matters in a sense when you are. I don't, I don't want to say winning, but you know, if you're doing good, ages is like okay, I'm doing better, and I can push maybe because we can force something, but. They are not really doing that good. Like, with the BKBs, they can still win, absolutely. I need to check the BKBs, though. Like, he is, like... I can actually see it. This is normal. <laughs> I can see shit. On my enemy team. No. I don't think they can push, though. Like, seriously. I don't see their push. Okay, Spectre is teleporting back. Alright. 
right. So we have two BKBs right there. Oh fuck, I actually fucked up there. Oh my god, I fucked up so fucking much. Oh fuck it. <laughs> Again? Oh my god. Can I like hit him? <laughs> oh man. Oh! <laughs> oh my god, critical! Yes! <laughs> he builds critical on the guy that is supporting it. It actually works. Oh my god. I missed the freaking sun strike. Sorry, in the sun strike, the tornado. Normally he would probably run top, but uh, he was porting, so he's like, oh, fuck it. Alright. Yeah, well, two BKBs. That's the unfortunate thing. It'll do a meteor. They don't really do anything. There were two guys with the BKBs there, so. Yeah. But still, as you can see, doesn't really matter at this point. I was like, I don't know why I did this shit. Like, I was actually like, okay, should I do it or should I not do it? I was like, he's not actually gonna do any damage to me right there, so. I don't know. But yeah, they have a part, we have to be kind of careful. Yes, like that. <laughs> oh! It's nobody there. Oh my god. Alright. <laughs> Oh, there's somebody. Hello! No, okay. I think it's time to run. There are three people. Like, it didn't seem so, but there's a lot of fucking people. Um. Okay, he's porting away. That's cool. That's cool. Sorry. I don't want to fucking go there. Yes, thank you. Run away! Okay, okay. Nope. I actually fucked up there. A little bit. Let's see. What? It was called snap. I clicked too much. Unfortunately, my orbs were fucked in a sense of it was like badly like managed. It was like Vex in the middle, so reforging was difficult. Reforging. Fuck, I was watching too much WoW, too much WoW. <laughs> I, was, I was watching Great Ink and WoW and... Reforging, yes, that's the word, that's the word. <laughs> My item level is 500, yes. Fuck. That's a cool game, I, I like WoW, I like WoW. You know, if I was... If I had money when I was like 11, when I was, you know, starting to watch the WoW, I was playing first beta. I would actually play by now, but obviously I didn't have money. As 11 years old. I was playing Ultima Online on a free server, man. <laughs> the cheap version of WoW. I was actually playing from 2001, so like WoW was not even there. And I kind of stopped in 2005, so it wouldn't actually matter because that was the year of, you know, WoW was... Like, of course it was like one year already, but still. I mean, I had a few mistakes there, like, nothing crucial, but unfortunately with the BKBs, as you can see, like, yeah. <laughs> it's pretty annoying as the invoker to stand against that. Like, I stand against that student against team with the 4 BKBs. I was like, oh, fuck it. <laughs> Is this gonna hit somebody? Nope. I was standing against team, yeah, 4 BKBs. It's just like, what the fuck I'm supposed to do, you know? It's like, there's nothing else for me to hear. <laughs> I should go to the next game. It's like, GG, go next, you know? That seems pretty bad. Does he black hole? He doesn't. Okay. I think he would if he had mana. Alright, he's pretty fast, this guy. Look at that. Manta style and everything. Daedalus. It's not really the usual build. <laughs> oh, she killed somebody just with the images. Interesting. I don't think CM is farmed enough. <laughs> Oh man, gank, ultra gank. That's fine. I got it. I'll be there in two seconds. The thing with the Enigma, I probably should do this combo. Um, 
But the thing is, if she hits black hole, you know, if she hits black hole. Holy fuck, okay, that's interesting. <laughs> okay. Well. <laughs> holy sh- holy oh. I was thinking like, who actually did the voiceover? <laughs> Had to be kind of a weird out with this, like you know, he's expecting some like serious job, and they're like, "Okay, you'll be saying holy shit, <laughs> ultra kill." <laughs> That'll be pretty weird. Okay, where's the team? Not there. Yeah, I like agony, man. It's pretty cool. Spectre, like that build actually works. It's funny. Oh man, we got Battle Fury. So right now she has everything that she needs, pretty much. I got the DK. Boom. I can actually do the combo. Hold on. Uh, I'm not really sure about the time though. Two point five seconds. So first sun strike, then uh, okay, and then yes. <laughs> I don't think you do that because it seems kind of weird to me. Like, pretty simple. Pretty simple stuff. Whoa. Let's actually do this, why not? I think he did. Okay, I don't want the guys fall that soon. Nope! <laughs> I just think Multicast like an insane one. Oh, she always do that, man. <laughs> That's a holy shit, man. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. You could be focusing on Raxus. I don't know. I would like that, probably. But that again. <laughs> oh, whatever. Can you, like, kill it? So it's a pretty cool game, you know, overall. Actually, first game for real game for today, so I was kinda clunky. I always do that. Like, if I'm playing first game for that day, I always play like a Pudge or Invoker. <laughs> I don't know why, but it works. It works usually, so it's fine. Go! Hit him! Yes! Fuck off. No, 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 no. <laughs> This doesn't help. Nope. Don't worry, I'm gonna get him. He could actually kill me, I think. Pretty easily. Why we are... Okay, here we go. That's a kill. Why am I here? Alright, so let's say thank you for watching uh, Game with Invoker. Pretty cool. Uh, that was the damage in the beginning, like... I mean, it, it's no big deal, you know. It's, it's okay, it's fine. I don't think I did anything special. But then again, first, first game for today. That's my excuse. I got fucked up a few actions, few, few, you know, few switches, but that's fine. I always get the chest, man. That's for Arza. By the way, the... Efficiency is not really good with the chests because you know it's like very little chance of getting a good item. And usually you can buy these items for actually less money than than the than the key. <laughs> you know, some items started for like one euro and the key is for like two, so yeah. So that is it. Pretty cool. Sixteen kills? Oh that's the Agonim build. That has to be it. <laughs>
I've 27 assists. That's, that's decent, but overall, you know, overall pretty decent, whatever. Okay, that's it. Thank you for watching.